Hey guys, welcome to this extra video. Gabby's new horse that she got in January has been lame for six weeks. Six long weeks. There have been so many discussions. There's been a lot of farrier appointments. There's been a vet appointment. There has been so much discussion among our trainers and so many comments from you guys. Is Chino still lame? For anybody who's just joining Chino's story now, um, his feet at the beginning of the summer, his feet grew really fast when they first went out onto grass and uh, they started to chip off, which wouldn't have been a big issue except for that he's a flat footed horse. So his feet kind of dished out and he ended up getting some bruises just from riding solely on the grass. Just from riding on grass, he got some bruises. You guys know bruising can take a really long time to heal, but it seemed like more than that to us. It really seemed like to us that he didn't like riding on the grass and that he was always being really careful where he put his foot and that's what made him look lame. And there was this big, huge debate between us, our vet, our farrier, and our trainers. Is Chino really lame? Today, we decided to drive him in to an arena, an indoor or a uh, sand arena and see what would happen with Chino. There have been moments over the last six weeks where we've been like, hey, he's not lame. And then the next day, he de appears to be dead. Late. He wanted to put an end to it once and for all. Is Chino actually lame? So this is a video of that. up there Gabby. Get down. Get down. Get down. <laughs> right so it poured rain for five minutes so we're gonna have to listen inside. We're back in the old stomping ground. Oh it's Chino's like my girlfriend's here. Come on Chino don't be lame for your girlfriend. Come on you show up for her. Show off for her. Both those girlfriends. He's like, look, and he's like, I want them. Don't be scared of cows. You weren't beside them before. You're okay with cows. He's like, I'm going to stand here and go out the door. He's like, save me. <laughs> I'm not a working pony. Gino, let's see if you're lame. Yeah, I think he's sound too. I think he's been sound all summer, but doesn't like riding outside. Uh, no. No, that horse is sound. Very sound. <laughs> It's 
If you've ruled out everything else, then get on them and give them a good tuning and say, like, enough of it. But it's Nick. What? Yeah. He's just happy to be moving. This horse likes to work. Oh yeah, remember the last time we rode here, he looked at everything. <laughs> he went over it all. Yeah, but now he was thinking all this time, like I'm just the relaxing in the field horse. So now he's like more focused on the fact that he actually has to work. But he's always wanted to work. I know, yeah. he has. He always went to the gate. I know. Like, First went to the... I know. The wicked witch is gone! Uh, that's exactly what I said. So when we put them on the trailer today, guess what they were like with little Gabby. Chino self loathes. He just went walking up there, marching up there like he was yeah, the king of the world. The first thing I got on the trailer, I said, well, Chino self loathes you right. That's true. And Finn pretty much self loaded. He's like, oh, there's my friend. Boo, straight up on that trailer. I'm he was like, I'm not staying here with Storm if that's the <laughs> alternative I'm going. Yeah, oh yeah, they they were like, they were on the, tr that's why we we're in the stalls, we put all three pony horses in stalls, because, You're afraid. Um, because Storm will get mad that he's by himself, Really? yeah, I he didn't care. as long as his friends are by him, and the ponies are so little, so if we put Storm in, uh, we would have had to put Storm in behind better fin fencing, so we would have had to put him in the uh, arena, he gets too hot back there. It's like hot and he freaks out. He doesn't like hot. Oh, yeah. yeah. He wouldn't like it in my place. No. Suck it up, buttercup. Yeah, which is probably the problem. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not I'm, I'm not dumb. I get it. I literally didn't think Storm was going to go back in the trailer the second day. Because it was so much work the first day. Yeah. He hopped right on though. He's trying to canter already. You pick me up when I'm down, and that's just one of many things that makes me believe that you're a dream. Yeah, it's no secret at all. It's so obvious. To
Gina's gonna canter. Yay! There's always like a few days when she's getting him back into work that she has to like really get back. The two of them have to get back into it because I, I, I didn't bring it. <laughs> he was like, yeah, I'm not really sure if I'm game for that. No, he was enjoying this summer. He enjoyed having the whole summer off. I like, she'd like to do a clinic on him. Yeah, yeah that would be nice. Yeah. On a horse Did action. Did you at least tell Kathy that Storm was not your main show horse? No, we yeah. just told her nothing. I would have brought that up. They, she did, they did talk to her. I would have said, this is my backup horse because my show horse is off right now. Yeah, she was probably thinking he should, this one should be off too. <laughs> I've heard her say it at other clinics though. I watched some videos and that's what she says. Like when a horse is really grouchy like that, you have to... Very bouncy. Yeah, he's got a lot of animation. Yeah, it's like bounce. <laughs> Turn your thumbs up. Close your fingers. Close your fingers. Look at that big black cloud. You won't melt. Gabby wrote a whole clinic in the rain. Well, I was really impressed she cleaned her saddle right as soon as she got off of it. I didn't have to tell her. All right, rising trot. Wow, that was a good transition. I think that's been a problem for all of our horses for a long time. Should I register for the show then? Well, what are you, which for what? One hour yet. So Gabby wants to okay. cross over and then Gabby two Let's foot, go. two foot, two foot three. On storm? Yeah. Yep. She can't, I mean she could do hack on this horse, right? Oh yeah. All right, so I'll let her choose. Yep. But they also have a derby. Good boy! Good boy! Give him a good scratch! 
So you give me he some. Did that very willingly. Yeah, he you give. Huh? Yeah, he was a little excited. Give me some. He can move. Give me some nice fitting, and I'll give you my best work. Yeah. I think he doesn't like the grass because it's not. Like I don't think he feels confident on it. Working trot. Hands forward. Yes, that was much nicer. He came down and out into the trot that time. Give him a good pat. Come on. Good boy. I love him. He looks so good. Like watching you on Storm. Storm was excellent. Storm. Storm. I need to clean my shoes. Storm rode his heart out for you. The storm's coming. Um, uh, but watching you on him is such a different, different look. Holy crap! It's getting cold. This should be interesting. Going where you're going, so I don't get killed. Okay, I'm expecting not Finn to stop. He never stops. I'm expecting to. Or your daughter to do that. That's too big. Yeah. Up. I didn't. Oh, what a good boy. Look <gasps> up. Close the little leg. Good boy. Tanner. Yeah, you're good, honey. Three, two, one. Beautiful. Give him a pat. Let him cool down. I thought he was coming for me. The rain is coming down. Everybody's getting wet to cool off. <laughs> 